TV land is how you make caffeine infused spaghetti. Doesn't it look totally delicious? Hey, I was watching that. Ugh, you are so lame. Let's watch this movie about some witches who try to steal everyone's energy. I am not lame. It's always been my dream to be a TV chef. Only instead of cookies and cupcakes, I'd focus on true exotic foods like tacos, burritos, and enchiladas. You do realize these exotic foods are of the same origin, right? Well then, I could just have a taco show. Just imagine, it could be Taco Tuesday every day. You, my friend, are an idiot. Hmm, now, now, girls, I think it's quite brilliant. Just imagine how much energy we could collect by a national television! Our reach would be unstoppable! Hey, it's everyone's favorite and competent minions, the Dazzling. Personally, I found the first Equestria Girls movie to be kind of, um, not really that great. But I thought Sonata Dusk and Arya Blaze really seemed to save the second. Sonata was just an airheaded joy, and then Arya was the perfect bickering partner. I also found their color schemes and designs super appealing, and I can't tell you how disappointed I am that they haven't been made into ponies. Opportunity lost, Hasbro. Seriously. The figures are actually pretty show accurate, which is amazing. It is unfortunate, though, that these guys have very little articulation. And yes, I did do a body swap with Pinkie Pie and Rainbow Dash for the video's intro. The retail price for this set is about 30 bucks, but at this point, you can probably find it for a lot less. I purchased this duo on Amazon back in the fall and unfortunately have just not had time to do a review. The Equestria Girls line has improved quite a bit, but Pony is still my priority. So, let's take a look at these guys outside the box. And I really think they would be absolutely perfect if they had articulation. Sonata is adorable and has no business at all being evil. She comes with pink sunglasses and has two-toned blue hair that's tied up in a ponytail. Both her bangs and ponytail seem to be layered, and her ponytail was a super frizzball mess when it came out of the package, but after a quick wash, it turned out okay. She's wearing a tie with her amulet, a striped shirt, a belt, and the shortest skirt ever. But, to make up for the short skirt, she has super high pink boots! Sonata also comes with a pair of clear wings that plug into her back, a microphone, and profile card. Arya's design is just as fun as Sonata's, only she looks a little more devilish. She has purple and green hair with long bangs and pigtails. Ari is wearing her amulet as a necklace, and then she's wearing a purple and green dress with some leggings. She also has purple shoes, clear wings that plug into her back, a microphone, and profile card. Well, that is it for Sonata and Aria. If you enjoyed this review and want to see more, please click subscribe. You can also follow me on social media for behind the scenes, pictures, previews, and other junk. You guys have a good one.
on cooking with Pinky, my secret ingredients are caffeine and sugar. Any food I make is getting